But when something relates to the audience, you want to look forward to say that, indicate that message. And also, in life as well, where the shop is In the heart of the Anaheim community, um, Danza actually hosted a financial literacy event where one of its goals is to spread financial literacy for everyone in the community and especially high school students. One of, our, one of the special honor guests that is here today that she showed his expertise and insights on finance today. And there's no one else but the California State Treasurer, John Chung, who has more information about this. Can you first introduce yourself? Yeah, good morning. It's great to be with you. I'm John Chung. I'm the California State Treasurer. Uh, the Treasurer is California's banker, so I'm responsible for the short-term investments of the state and other government's cash. I'm also responsible as the agent of sale of the state's debt. We sell bonds to build beautiful facilities such as this one for highways, for bridges, for water projects. Uh, so those are a couple of my responsibilities. And then I also chair over a dozen economic development agencies. We want to grow more jobs in California. We want to make sure that we have a clean, healthy environment. Um, you have a lot of important roles, but what are some involvements that you put yourself in for the community and the state of California? Well, I wanted to make sure that I come out and, uh, as we discussed today, uh, financial education. It's very important that we help people live their dreams and so that if we can make sure that they have the best expertise to handle their own investments, how to handle loans, how to help other financial uh, aspects of their life, I think we can make sure that we have more Californians enjoy the incredible California opportunities. How crucial it is for everyone to have knowledge about finance? Well, everybody needs to have uh, knowledge. It's a very competitive world. It can be incredibly challenging. Life circumstances may uh, create issues for individuals and families. So we want to make sure that people have the best financial wherewithal, and that comes through education. And also, what is, um, I heard that you're content contemplating that you want to be a candidate for the state governor. What are your thoughts on that? Oh, so I'm here to be supportive of the students today, so they, uh, I'm not really talking about uh, a, a future election. See, and do you have an advice for high school students about finance, or they should be ready for, prepared for, for college in terms of money? Well, finance, like anything else, uh, they should make sure that they understand it. Uh, finance, uh, having money, is a, uh, is a substitute for their life experiences. So if you have some money, you may be able to travel to Paris, uh, you can get a car, you can get your uh, you know, smart technology, and so it's important to understand finance. Most importantly, it's important to have a love of learning. And what are your plans in the future? I'm going to continue to work hard on behalf of the uh, people of the state of California. Uh, as I did I am with you and with the others today, I'm just so excited about our future. And so I think all of us working together can make uh, the communities that we reside in uh, healthier, better, more inspiring. Thank you so much. As a representative of teenagers in the community, we are very honored that the California State Treasurer has dedicated some of his time to be here with us today, spreading knowledge, his insights on finance, and that it's very beneficial for the community. And thank you so much for being with here with us today, and we will send you more news next time. Thank you so much, and thank you. Thank you. Great to be with you. Thank you. Does that make sense?